Cassini has captured a wealth of information about Saturn's moons Enceladus in recent months, but the planet's Phoebe moon has been left by the wayside in comparison. In a rare image, taken by NASA's spacecraft, the distant satellite has been captured in all its pockmarked glory. Phoebe orbits at a staggering distance of 8,049,668 miles, 12,952,000 kilometers, from the planet and, unlike Saturn's other moons, it sits in darkness, reflecting just 6% of the sunlight it receives. Phoebe is roughly spherical and has a diameter of 132 miles, 220 kilometers, around 1 15th the diameter of Earth's moon. It rotates on its axis every 9 hours, and it completes a full orbit around Saturn in about 18 months. Phoebe's orbit is also retrograde, which means it goes around Saturn in the opposite direction than most other moons, as well as most objects in the solar system. Unlike most moons orbiting Saturn, Phoebe is dark. This darkness and irregular, retrograde orbit suggest Phoebe is most likely a captured object. A captured object is a celestial body trapped by the gravitational pull of a much larger body, generally a planet, also known as a centaur. Saturn's Dark Moon Phoebe Saturn's moon Phoebe orbits at a distance of 8,049,668 miles, 12,952,000 kilometers, from the planet, almost four times the distance of its moon Iapetus. Phoebe is roughly spherical and has a diameter of 132 miles, 220 kilometers, around 1 15th the diameter of Earth's moon. Phoebe's orbit is also retrograde, which means it goes around Saturn the opposite direction than most other moons, as well as most objects in the solar system. Unlike most major moons orbiting Saturn, Phoebe is dark and reflects only 6% of the sunlight it receives. Its darkness and irregular, retrograde orbit suggest Phoebe is most likely a captured object. A captured object is a celestial body trapped by the gravitational pull of a much larger body, generally a planet. Phoebe's darkness, in particular, suggests the small moon comes from the outer solar system. Saturn's moon Enceladus Enceladus is Saturn's sixth largest moon, one of 62, discovered in 1789 by William Herschel. In the early 1980s NASA sent two Voyager spacecraft to the Saturnian system to capture the first close-up images of the moon. Voyager 1 made its flyby on November 12, 1980 but captured only poor resolution shots that revealed a highly reflective surface that didn't appear to have any craters on it. Voyager 2 made its closest approach on August 26, 1981 during which its higher resolution images instead revealed the surface to be heavily cratered in the north and lightly cratered around the equator. NASA's Cassini craft began multiple flybys of Enceladus in 2005 and was able to identify cryovolcanoes near the South Pole that shoot geyser-like jets of water vapor, and last month Cassini spotted evidence for a large ocean beneath Enceladus' surface. The plume was first spotted by Cassini in 2005, a year after it arrived in the Saturnian system. Around 100 geysers erupting from surface features known as tiger stripes were identified as its source. The four 1.2 mile wide, 1.9 km wide, aligned cracks are believed to be sites of heightened volcanic activity on Enceladus.